Hello everyone, welcome back to the Road to Street Fighter 6. We beat Street Fighter 1. Everything from here on out should be a lot better. Uh, because that game was jank. But now we're going to what made the Street Fighter saga what it is. The game that brought it to the next level. Even if right now, it's not as much. Uh, this one is definitely one of the, what some people view as, you know, definitely still the weaker ones. Uh, I'm going to go with difficulty level 1. I'm going to gradually raise it up as I play through Street Fighter 2s. Because I'm not good at Street Fighter 2. Game's weird. But uh, let's check out the game info. Street Fighter 2, the world warrior built on the successes of the first Street Fighter and fix a vast number of weaknesses as an early title. The Street Fighter 2 series went on to become one of the most popular fighting games, indeed game franchises in general of all time. Compared to the first game, the changes are huge. There are eight playable characters and four CPU control boss characters, Balrog, Vega, Sagat, and Bison. That's not wrong, depending on, you know, no matter what region you're in. The roster of special and regular attacks is dramatically increased, including throws and grabs, which were not present in the first game. Players can also cancel their attacks by performing another move during another move's animation, allowing for combinations of basic and special moves. This accidental feature uh, ultimately led to a more robust combo systems today. Yeah, so that was not meant to be in. Um, after three uh, matches in the same game, players can uh, play one of three bonus games. There's a barrel breaking game in which barrels fall off a conveyor belt from above, an oil drum breaking game in which a pyramid of flaming oil drums must be smashed, and the now famous car breaking minigame similar to the final fight bonus round. Oh my car! It's in Japanese, they say oh my god, but in, um, in, in they, they, sw they censored it to oh my car. Round lengths are 99 seconds, and if a match ends in a draw or double KO, additional rounds will be played until sudden death. As a particular oddity for the World Warrior, this can go up to 10 rounds if the winner is not determined. If the 10th round is a tie as well, either the CPU opponent wins or both of them wins. Trivia! Chun-Li, who debuted in Street Fighter II The World Warrior, was the first female playable character in any fighting game. Canceling one attack into another or normals into specials was actually a glitch. This glitch actually created the ideas of combos which forever changed how fighting games were played. Initially, the side-scrolling beat -em up final fight was going to be named the second Street Fighter title, Street Fighter 8-9, which I did a full playthrough of on uh, here already. Yoko Shinomura's iconic soundtrack was initially meant to evoke stages rather than characters. We now associate Gal's theme with his character, though, even though it goes with everything, happy they put in that meme. Some of the bugs, uh, some of these are bugs, but most are beloved by players around the world. It's possible for Ryu and Ken to throw a red Hadouken, although it is random and it does the same damage as normal Hadouken. It does look cool. What is this? The 512 Special Attack and Guard. There's a 1 in 512 chance that a random button press will result in a special move as well as a 1 in 512 chance that a character will guard without holding back. These were put in as a way to help new players see some of the awesome special attacks each character had, and to help those who have a weak defense game. Wow! Can you imagine? That's crazy. That's super cool. The fact that they're like, because in arcades, right, when this first came out, I, was, I don't think these ones had the, the, the moves on the, on the cab. So it's like, okay, we're going to make it so that you have a chance of doing a special move. So you'd be like, yo, I did this crazy thing, right? Uh, in, in the World Warrior, it wasn't possible to play against the same character as the one you're playing. But if you reach Ryu's stage and lose, then continue as player 2 and choose Ryu. You'll have a Ryu versus Ryu mirror match. But watch out, they'll be the same color. Okay, I see. Well, uh, let's, uh, let's, I want to see if I can get the intro to start back up. Can I do that? Can I just hit, uh see here just let's just let's just go out and back in because I, I, I want to I, I realized I didn't show up the intro last time here we go oh so good on oh, the classic artwork on the side yeah 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 Street Fighter 2 has a good aesthetic going for it it really does. Every Street Fighter has its own aesthetic kind of going in. All right. So, we have a variety of characters to choose from, but I think we're going to go with the character that uh, is considered by many Americans to be the main character, at least when this game came out. We're going to go with... Gail. Dina. I love, I love the announcer. I love it so much. Yo, Orange Chun-Li. Nah, just kidding. I love this stage, actually. Come on. I'm trying to- I'm try, I tried to do flash kick. Okay, flash kick is not working the best. 
Okay, come on. There we go. Again, I'm, I'm using a controller. Okay. Of course, the problem with playing Guile is his gameplay style is called turtling. And, like, you're supposed to try and... And turtle out the stuff. Oh, we're gonna lose. Okay, we gotta get more aggressive. Okay, we gotta get way more aggressive. Sounds good. We can do that. That's fine. Alright, more aggressive. I love his double kick there. I love his advancing punch. I wish the flash kick was more reliable, huh? It definitely is. You gotta press exactly, like, perfectly time it, huh? There we go. You wait for the jump and you hit the flash kick. That's that's what you do with him. Okay. And as usual, I'm gonna hit those save states just so I don't have to do multiple rounds, right? All right. So yeah, Chinley has like a wall kick in this, which I think is in a lot of later Street Fighters, but it's just something I always forget that she has. Okay, got the throw. Jump. Just just compare how how not very often the CPU uses special moves, right? Like it's just a change of how the game was. Okay, there we go. God, his eyes, just blue dots, staring at you. Are you man enough to fight with me? Guile, come on, bro. Come on. USA! No, Brazil. Uh-oh, you're going to Brazil. I do find it funny when people are like, man, is this what Capcom thinks Brazilians are like? And it's like, no, this was just a... A fun character design that they're like, well, where, where, where will we put him? Let's put him in Brazil. Well, because it makes sense because he like, he that's that's where he fell, you know, out of the airplane. Little Jimmy there. Little Jimmy went to Brazil and fell out the airplane. Okay, I was tried to flash kick there. No blocker, not the head bite. Oh, man, you're going to get tons of like classic Street Fighter memes from me. I love the fact- oh, frick! I love the fact that they re-released, uh, or they released a DVD for Street Fighter, the, the animated series, the, the Western one, and the entire box art was just full of, uh, memes there from, from, you know, classic videos making fun of it. It's a bad series, but I think it's hilarious. Okay. No, not that. I hate the head bite. One more hit. <laughs> wait, wait. Who did it? Is that a double KO? Wow. That's a double KO, all right. Oh, it just completely goes to round three, huh? Okay. God, his little flip kick is so weird. But damn if it doesn't help you dodge some attacks, huh? Oh. No, I'm stunned! Oh, and this was back in the era where, like, stun was completely random. Okay. Like not like stun time, stun gauge, all that was literally completely random. 
There we go. Whoo, that was a bit close. That was a bit close. And again, it's only a bit close because it's like the, 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 the input timings are very specific, right? Also, yeah, is this, is it, this is, yeah, two, two move, two move guile there, right? Before he, before he really got more. Okay. Yeah, nice. There we go. See? That's a good little combo. Yeah, back in this era, it's like your combo might be like three or four hits, right? But this is before you got more and more. Oh man, I hate I actually really don't like the damaged portraits. These people get messed the frick up. Okay, time to battle the geef. Who wears a leotard in his opening, and then not here. This stage is wacky, though. For some reason, the, the phrase bear factory is what comes to mind when I look at this one. Okay. I absolutely love that come Smash Ultimate. It's like, you know, the, 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 uh, according to Sakurai, the master of grappling in video games is Zangief. Because, you know, he's he's the spirit for that master's grappling. I think that's amazing to be like, we're going to make the guy who represents the concept of throwing be Zon Z Zangief, Zangief, however you say it. Everyone's favorite Disney character. I'm happy he's wearing pants, though, now. I really am. I thought the Speedo look... I mean, part of it's iconic, but also part of it's... I don't love it a ton. Okay. Why is he so... Like, what... What grappler distances themselves in that way, right? I mean, then again, I am uneasy, I guess. It's just strange to see him, like, walking backwards. Right? Are you mad enough? Okay, here we go. Oop. Nope, gotta get over. Okay. Am I gonna do it? Nope. We weren't perfect timed. Oh well. No. Oh my car. Japan. I love Ryu's big old, big old cute boy eyes. This is the Street Fighter, baby. You know, this could also be Smash Bros. Okay, but re honestly. Sakurai making the the Street Fighter Sis trophy just be Guile crouching. Like Guile holding down back is the funniest thing. Okay. Dang. Dang Ryu, calm down, bro. I know you're the poster boy, but come on. Also, like, what, what, what a drip upgrade, right? Giving the red headband to represent the old weird red hair, right? German suplex. Okay. Dang, he really do be baiting that out. Yeah, he can break those. I think those are gone in later Street Fighters. The cool, um, breakable signs and stuff. Dang! He got me on the jump in. Alright. That's okay. You must defeat Shenlong to stand a chance. The who? That we know. That's that. that it's actually a sure you can. That's that's what he said. He's, you must defeat my sure you can to stand a chance. Shenlong, Dra Shen. Like it sounds like dragon, right? So.
That's why. Dragon Punch. Yeah. There is no Shenlong, although you can kind of count um, Goken. Goken kind of, of, of became Shenlong. Because when this happened, they, they, they ran with Oh yeah, Shenlong's a secret character in like magazines and stuff, which then led to Akuma. Okay, so I'm just gonna wait for him to jump at me. Yep, that's the idea. Oh, not the best. Dang! My man had the frame data advantage. Okay, that's fine. The, the literal main character advantage, huh? Come on. There we go. I really wish it was more consistent. It might be better on an actual fight stick. Again, I'm just too far away from my my system to uh, to use it there. And the the leg created by a USB extender ain't worth it either. Dang! Wow! Wow! He got the footsies on me. He gave me the. Whap, whap, One more try. I love the, the glint in the eye. It's like, I ain't done yet. Okay. There we go. Oh, my fingers. The fear of holding down back. It's a good thing there's no more Shotos to go through, am I right? It's a good thing I don't have to fight another Shoto later, am I right? Oh boy, where are we off to now? India. Okay. Dalsim. Dalsim might be either super easy or super difficult. It all just depends on... Yeah, look, I love I love the fact that I got stunned immediately. Isn't this great? Oh my goodness! Dalsim with the 90% combo. So yeah, the whole thing with Dalsim is get in close, you can beat him far away, you're in for trouble. Okay. We got this, though. Yeah. He also has that perfectly angled kick of... I don't know if that'll hit from crouch block, though. I don't know if that counts as a... Something that'll work there. See, that's what I want. Yeah, because it, it makes more sense to just throw, right? Why would I do anything otherwise? All right, let's hit that save there. Just so we don't have to do more than we need. Because as you can see, the computer will be like, yeah, let's just have it so that you get take, uh, you know, as much damage as, as we let you. Like, there was a few times fighting Ryu there where I was 100% certain his fireballs were breaking my crouch, my crouch block. And, like, there's nothing you can do about it because it's just... In this era, that whatever the CPU says goes, right? How how did he block that so quickly? Does my man not have any down frames from that?
Now, the good thing is he has very floaty jumps, which means it is very easy to do a flash kick on him when he jumps on in, which he's not doing. He's turtling me out. Okay, we lost there. Yeah, he turtled me out there of my own volition. All right. Oh, yo, with the air throw. I didn't even know Street Fighter 2 had air throws. See, then sometimes the CPU just lets you get these hits in. Uh, or, or lets you get set on fire still. I love how everyone has the same fire effect when they get burned. Like, it's the same sprite. No matter who you are, when you're burning, we're all the same. That sounds super grim. I don't like that. Are you mad enough to fight with me? All right. Japan. Yeah, e Honda time. Is this, this is bathhouse stage? I love the bathhouse stage. All right. I gotta say, the least popular character out of Street Fighter 2 is gotta be Honda, right? Okay, I'm mashing. I just, I just don't know anyone who's, who's like, yeah, I'm, a, I'm, I'm a big E Honda fan. They might like his gameplay style, but as a character, I don't know. Hmm. That background actually got changed in uh, subsequent re-releases of Street Fighter 2. Um, if you get any modern re-release, that is gone. Because uh, anyone who knows anything about the Rising Sun pattern, it's uh, not considered that good of a thing nowadays. So, that is something that has changed. It, like, not to say it's on it's on the, the wavelength. Stop. Stop. Like, there's just nothing you can do, huh? And that leads to follow-ups, too. It's not on the level of, say, a swastika, right? But it still has similar connotations, so that's why they change it to just be a regular uh, sun there. All right. Ken is really sneering in there. It's not just I'm angry, it's, ooh, look at you, right? Okay. So, so, more so than Zangief, don't let him get in, huh? God, I'm, God, I miss being able to just do charge moves with no problem whatsoever. I love charge moves. Like, I, I'm a big fan of charge moves, and I actually find them more reliable than motions. At least, at least I, I did for a bit. Now, now I'm pretty good with motions. I just put the controller down. There's nothing I can do, huh? Okay, so I do have like a good one, two, three with him, right? All right, so yeah, I think I think this is gonna need to be another. What's with what's with the Japan characters being the strongest? Hmm, you got something to say to that, Capcom? We'll do one more before I start just grinding my head against this guy. I wonder if I hit him with a fireball when he's doing the the hundred slaps. Will that disintegrate it, or will it do something else? I wonder. Like, like, will it actually hit him? Jump at me. Thank you. Come on, jump at me. Thank you. Come on, jump at me. That's not a jump. Jump at me. Jump at me. Jump at me. Jump at me. So, uh, yeah, I, 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 I was blocking. I was blocking that. Do you see what I mean by saying that it just doesn't... It just doesn't let you sometimes? I was holding back that whole time. I would never let go in the middle of a E Honda 100 hand slaps. That's just insanity to even consider that. Okay. Cool. I love missing my opportunity. Okay, 
Okay. This is the era, too, where chip damage was, like, maximum. Come on. Just need one more jump in. Look at that chip damage! Look at that chip damage! My man's hitting me with chip damage more than a regular light punch! Alright, here we go. I got a round on him. Oh boy. Oh boy. I wonder if there's a maximum number of battles there. Okay, he's hit, hit me with the anti-air. Do you see that? No. No iframes. Whatsoever. He can just, he can just, oh, what's that? You caught me a frame after I finished my attack? Guard. Jump. Jump at me. Jump at me. That was a bit wacky. Jump at me. Don't do scoy. Jump at me. I'm trying to... I'm trying to Sonic Boom! Okay, we won. I was trying, and it wasn't working. It just... It wouldn't work. It wouldn't work! It's just every now and then, the frames get a bit janky, and it's like... I'm like, don't press buttons there. I did watch your video, though, on... Oh, cool. Uh, oh, I suck at this one! I did watch a video on... Oh, the, yeah, I, I hate this one. I've never, even in Street Fighter 4, I can't beat this one. Wait, is it only, wait, no, what, does one medium do it? No. Weird. Um, I watched a video on how the frames work in, like, the, the frame delay. Yeah, I, I can never do these ones. The, this one, I can't do even in Street Fighter 4. That one's tough. Oh boy, versus cat. I hate that versus logo. This stage is sick. But man, if I suck at this, also hey Q. Oh boy. Just get a free round on me, huh? No. Doesn't matter. Just in instantly. Instant TP, man. Instant TP, that's how it works, I guess. Oh boy. Ryu 2, Electric Ryu Alu. Also, battle between um, brother in laws. <sighs> yeah, this 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 is gonna be another one of of pain. Attack me if you dare, I will crush you. Okay. Here we go. Try this again. Approach me. Jump at me. Oh. So I, in one round versus Ryu, that happened, and he literally had not enough, um, like, the, his stun was so short, I took one step towards him and it was over. Also perfect. Nice. I took one step towards him, and he was out of stun. It's entirely random. The, when you get stunned, how long... That is wild. The concept of RNG in fighting games in general is like a hot topic now, right? But to have whole game concepts behind RNG is insane. Okay. Jump at me. Oh wow, you tie you 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 did the science on that to make sure that hit exactly where you wanted, huh? Oh nice. That's uh, this actually went pretty easy. Okay. He wasn't as mad as Ryu. Hmm. You got something to say about that, Capcom? I'm gonna keep accusing them of stuff. I haven't seen Ken this washed up since. <laughs> Alright. Balrog time. Not Mike. No, no, no. This stage is great. 
I don't know if this really sounds Vegasy, but it's pretty good. I do like the idea of, all right, you beat up these characters that you can play as. Now here's some like super bosses that are like really difficult and have cheating moves. I mean, more so than normal. See, that's what I mean. Did you see how how short that stun was? Couldn't even get over there. I really like this theme too. Probably one of my favorite. The probably my favorite of the Shadowloo themes. I tried to grab him. I tried to grab him. So yes, of course, in Japanese, he is. Uh, this is M Bison. Is he bleeding? I think that isn't that a isn't that a Mike Tyson thing where he bled from like a a, a thing on him. I think so. Zangief in Alpha also has that where he just like ruptures a thing in his head. Dang, dang, bro, those punches go long. So yeah, he was, yeah, he's, he's, something's busting behind him. My fists have your blood on them. Maybe it was that. Um, he was M. Bison, too close to Mike Tyson, changed him to Balrog, which is like, I think it's, I think Balrog fits him more than the other guy. So he has no kicks, though. Like that that is that is a thing with him. He's all punches. He has six punch buttons, which makes sense for a boxer. Yeah, these guys these guys might give a bit of a bit of a rough time. That throw does so much damage, it's always worth it to take. Alright. No, that's the guy in the back throwing confetti or popcorn, I guess. Yes, whatever he's throwing. He's throwing something. He's throwing something. You know, those Vegas popcorn throwers. Sure love just being punched in the face. He tried to do a crazy turn thing there. Okay. Alright, that's fine. I love the Blanca loading ball. It's so smart. Three times. Look how much damage he's doing through Chip. There we go. Nice. Again, sometimes just the rounds go better. All right. Up to Spain. Spain. Versus Vega. This tavern stage, which again, he can just cheat off of. This this stage is banned in every every time it appears that he can climb on the wall. Okay. Oh, cool! You can just supersede my flash kick! Oh, cool! Nice! That's good! I do like Vega. I, I'm fine with him not coming back for future games, because he's had his time in the sun, for sure. But I'm also super fine with him being just, you know... Like, I like him. He was actually my main when Street Fighter V first launched. Uh, just because I really liked how he felt. That's the cheating. Okay, so I don't I don't think I can Okay. There we go. I don't think there's anything you can do. I think he's like fully invincible up there. There was another game that added a little gate for him to climb around on. And I think I think it might be one of the alphas where it was one of his his grooves there. I think all the grooves are something that I'm definitely not super into. Like, I, I'm not, not not into, but I don't really know much about him. First hit stun, baby. Okay. This was definitely more like... Like, yeah, you could rally around this as a competitive scene, but could you imagine just someone getting bad 
stun RNG and like that's it at a tournament. Right? Like that would suck. So there's a reason that, you know, this got iterated on as time went on. See this this is the smart boy move. Okay, until he does that. That is that is that the the one slash there is you can do that as him in um in five there the actual descending slash part like that 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 part isn't isn't cheating but just being able to climb up there fully invincible is any any stage specific matchups are usually banned for good reason especially in the world of some of them being DLC right. We had a good first round there, but man, now he's going after us, huh? Okay, so you can just block it normally. Okay, good to know. Just block it. That's all you gotta do. Alright. Jump at me. Yeah, jump at me. Jump at me, bro. Jump at me, bro. Jump at me, bro. Okay. So sometimes he doesn't want to do it. And sometimes the game's like, no, you don't get that. Okay. Yeah, then he runs right up to you, huh? So when he approaches, I got to get ready with that. That standing, you know, or, or crouching light or whatever. Okay. That also works. That almost works better. Oh, I can just mash that out. Ooh. Okay, wait. That's new tech. I can just mash... I can mash the light. And then when he is approaching... From the top, do a flash kick. Oh, but, but that almost feels like it makes the game go faster. You feel that? Yo, what's with the speed? Yeah, that, 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 for some reason it feels like it's making the game go way too fast. Of course that was a thing that he could also do in Street Fighter V. Of course, yep. Yep, how, how could I have forgotten that? Yeah, it seems to make the game run faster? Or maybe just my reaction time slower? Okay. Being a little more aggressive. I... With that, all right, let's get this done. There we go. Oh, my God, that. So he, I mean, I fought him enough that I can tell his AI changes halfway through. And I actually did have the 516 glitch happen to me. I was mashing kind of crouch block in the corner. And uh, in doing so, very cool. Go the wrong way, bud. In doing so, um, like going like that. And then what happened was is, uh, oh, this is the easiest one, huh? There we go. Uh, in doing so, I was holding back and then just pressing it, and then he did a sonic boom, and I'm like, I very clearly didn't do a sonic boom there. Uh, I might cut it in if I remember to put it in, because I was like, oh yeah, cool, that is that is a thing, huh? 
All right. Spelled correctly this time. This is Sagat with the scar and everything on there, right? I just realized, yeah, they totally recreated all of the um, the, the, the 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 devas of Shadaloo's stages. In is that just what all you're gonna do, bud? They recreated them in Street Fighter Five, huh? Yeah. All right. Oh man. Oh boy. Oh, that's what we're gonna get into. Uh, tiger, tiger. Yep, yeah, that's that's Sagat, all right. Oh, you can make him jiggle. All right. Okay, that works really good. Come on. Come on. He waited. He waited and jabated. All right. You're not a warrior, you're a beginner. No, we're not. I mean, technically we are. Technically, Gal's a newcomer in this game, which is weird to think about. All right, I'm gonna pop that. I'm gonna pop that save right here just so that we don't have to go through that. And plus, I don't like the, the, the battle counter constantly going up. That makes me nervous. I'll say this, just out the bat, he feels a lot easier than uh, Vega, who feels like he cheats. I'll be honest, Sagat's stages always make me want to actually go to Thailand. Like, if there's if there's one place that, from Street Fighter, I want to visit, it's like, yeah. Okay, his double kick there kind of sucks. Because it's like, like, it's good if it hits, but man, if it don't, if it don't, you're open for days. Okay, don't do that. Don't. Oh uh, no. Okay, I won't. I won't save scum entirely. Never mind. I will. I got dizzied right away. That sucks. That sucks, yo. All right, here we go. Oh man. What is this timing? Well, obviously that's that was predetermined by the RAM. That was super predetermined by the RAM. All right. I might as well take the first loss if I need to. You gonna approach me, bro? Okay. 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 <laughs> All right. Yeah. Okay. That's nice. That's really nice. That's really nice. Okay. I love how holding buttons lets that fast forward. That was something I... Oh, it's, is it stopping at 18 now? I gravely miss that in Street Fighter 1. Okay. He's so big. He's so big. Man, so huge. Man, so big. Nothing he can do. All right. Are you man enough to fight with me? Here we go. Whoa, vice in your eyes, bro. Vice in your eyes. Vice in your traced art from um, Kinikuman. Oh, by the way, there's no way in hell I'll be unlocking um, Akuma. Don't worry about it. Like, not in this one. I know he's not in this one, but in later versions, there's no... Oh, really? That's what we're doing? That's what we're doing? Oh, you are a threat. You are a problem. Okay. Well. All right. You got a fast throw. Okay. Oh, baby. Okay. This is, yeah. Woo. Bison got those, uh, those, those fast moves, huh? Okay. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, there's just, just not a lot of nothing you can do, huh? 
you just you just hope for the best I was holding back is that a low what in tarnation what the heck that is absolutely unfair do I gotta be hyper aggressive with him is that what it is can I not turtle here well, it doesn't seem to matter, because he gets stunned so fast. He gets... He's like, what's that? Did you get hit? Enjoy this free stun that I can use forever on you. Yeah, that's obviously a jump attack. Oh, what? How? How? He does those cheekbones are very gaunt. Okay. Don't don't put myself in the corner. Don't do that. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? That's just that's just dumb. Why would I put myself in the corner like that? All right. Oh, that damage. Just just 50% me up, bro. I don't care. Whatever, man. Oh, frick. Okay. Time to see when I get this. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are you serious? Jumping light kick? <laughs> Jumping light kick is the savior we needed? Okay, wait, hold up. Oh, we came so close that time, though. Uh, excuse me, jumping light kick? Jumping light kick, what were you doing, bro? That was pretty good. Also, are they- are these proxy normals? Oh my god. That's ridiculous. We did really good with that, huh? Yeah, it's just new. it's just this. Give him the stanky leg. Who would have known Guile's stanky leg was so strong? I mean, it's not perfect. But man, is it pretty good. Okay, well, that's our strategy from here on. Okay, we'll give that a try. I did it. Oh, baby. That only took me 45 minutes. Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Hey, Bison. Remember me? Me and Charlie. Remember Cambodia? I remember Guile. Er, I remember Guile. You're not... The runt. You were then. Who's the little girl? Go ahead, kill me quickly. Is that his daughter? Honey, stop. Jane? Please, dear. Killing Bison won't bring Charlie back. He's gone to Candy Mountain. It was simply make you a murderer. Which is funny because, I mean, they super killed Bison later. Just like Bison. Please come home and be a family man. Let's start over. But I... But I deserted you. I love how they don't say who's speaking. Please, I forgot that he has a kid. I completely forgot he actually has a kid. Mommy and I still love you. Amy? Is that my little 
Amy? Wow, you've not even seen your daughter. Wow, look at look at his outfit. Would you like some tea, dear? <laughs> honey, honey, what's wrong? Huh? Oh, nothing, sweetheart. I just feel like I'm waking up from a long nightmare. I completely forgot he's a dad. I love you, Jane. Look at that pupper. Bork! 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 My ear extends! Bork! Bork! Game over. That was not... Okay, I take it back. I don't love playing as Guile. Um, oh boy, those charges just sometimes feel a little jank, but we did it. We beat Street Fighter 2. Let's move on over to the modern version via Street Fighter 5. Okay, here we are with Street Fighter 2. Though, of course, there are some characters here who aren't going to be uh, ones that we, we will have seen. We're going to be Guile. And we got to go with his classic outfit, of course. I mean, he's got some good alternate colors and stuff. Actually, Tan Guile is kind of cool. Is that literally just his regular, but with with a bit of... Yeah, let's go with that one. He's he's in he's in the the sun there, so uh, we'll go with Sonic Blade, and I love Sonic Blade. I've not used Knife Edge. Let's see what that is. Oh boy, we're going right in with this, huh? Okay, right in with Ryu, who gave me trouble last time. Okay, like even he's in like his classic outfit. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Okay, here we Round go. One. God, it's, yeah, it's super improved. Oh, man. You have no idea how good this feels now. It, it, it feels like taking off the shackles, man. Oh, right, it boosts his, um, his, his kicks there. Oh, so good. Oh, man, guys, this is such an improvement. Oh, he says easy operation. That's like what they called the Street Fighter sort of things where you could, uh, you, you could, you could play with easy controls. It was Street Fighter easy operation. That was, that was a SM, no, SK, SNK vs. Capcom 2 for the GameCube was called EO, Easy Operation. Oh, I tried to EX that and I missed the button input. Jump in, jump in. Jump in, I dare you, dude. Or just not. There we go. Oh, it just feels so nice though to go into this. Oh, I forgot to do the unique um, wins too. My blade tears through everything, even your Hadoken. Uh, let's go after. Let's go to Honda. So we fought him there. Jimmy can wait. Don't trust no Jimmy players. Plus, we're going like you know, we're going to the 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 his bathhouse, which again I love that stage. All right, Honda time. Honestly, I wasn't really a big fan of them putting E Honda in because I still think he's pretty lame, all things considered. But I do really like how they gave him the best story mode in the game. It's literally just him explaining to foreigners how to go to a Japanese uh, bathhouse, which if you, which I do highly recommend. I really loved going to a bath in Japan. It's like the most freeing thing. Also, he can crawl, which is great. Do your weird kick. There it is. You're done, bro. Easy. 
See, it's no longer the uh, the uh, the rising sun there, because uh, again, not considered very kosher. It's also just the fact that every button just feels better in this, right? Like, that's absolutely a thing. Oh, what's his super? I forget how to do his super here. It's... Okay, so do, 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 do. Okay. Big anchor arms. I love his anchor arms. Nice. Yeah, him getting big dumb anchor arms is incredible. It looks like he's slightly tomato-esque in here. I'll say that for sure. If this was a sumo match, I would have lost. Yeah, right. I mean, you're not wrong. Oh, we got to go versus the Geef. We got to get that. Let him get his run back where I demolished him. And, like, when I think Street Fighter 2, I think the thing that comes to mind is this stage with, with Zangief, right? Oh, and again, I'm going to call him Zangief forever. I don't, I don't, I don't care. Round one. All right. Fight. Oh, that's why I called it the Bear Factory, because there's a bear there. Hey, shout out to that, uh, that gauge over there, the, the stun gauge. Oh, I love his little kick forward, too. I tried to do it. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, I forgot about these. Oh, man, I forgot. I hope these are, I hope those are back for Street Fight. Like, there's so few of them in this game. But I really hope they bring them back for Street Fighter 6. I love those round losing things. I always forget about them. There we go. Oh, it just feels... Like, when we're talking about evolution of a franchise, it really does feel like just going to the next level. Your muscles cannot protect you against my techniques. Uh, we didn't fight Cammy, so we'll go after Dalsim. Does he... I wonder if he wears his classic costume when you're doing this. Because they did add that in. I know some people really like him with the beard. I didn't love it at first. I think it's... Yeah, he's in his classic costume. I didn't love it. I think it's a neat thing to have, but I think I preferred him clean shaven just from a design standpoint. That said, Round one. new drip looks Fight. real good. So, also this stage is really cool. I really, I think it's a really good depiction of India, right? Like it's, it doesn't feel stereotyped, which you know I think Street Fighter is trying to definitely get away from. It's hard to do that in the world warriors, right? To not stereotype. But I feel like this is a, I feel like in general, this game has a really good depiction of India there, right? Where it's like, you know, for one, there's like, you know, you still got some funny stuff, but like you got like the monk with like the, the, the with his uh, cell phone there, you know, I think it's, it's just a, it's just a better, healthier way of doing it, right? He even got the elephants there still. Stupid little kick. Whoops. I'm trying to I'm trying to do his super. Yeah, there. You, you, that that could have been blocked, obviously, but uh, I think because I'm not on harder difficulties, it's like it's treating me pretty easily. Can you imagine getting? beat up in front of your wife and son there. I've grown tired of your bizarre fighting techniques. 
Oh frick, there's wait, there's bonus stages? Oh man, I okay. I didn't know this was here. Oh right, this is where 2P is! I forgot that he like helps you out, quote unquote. Like he's he's like guitar. Yeah, we we missed that one. Thanks, buddy. You're doing real good. Okay, we're actually not doing too bad, all things considered. Oh, never mind. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have spoke. So this guy is from Final Fight, so we're absolutely seeing him in World Tour mode, right? We're absolutely seeing this dude in World Tour. Oh, he's so mad. He's so mad. I wouldn't be surprised if they brought back this exact minigame, and that's in Abigail's workshop, right? Oh, are we onto the Davis already? Oh, dang. Okay. All right. Balrog. Classic Balrog, classic stage, all that good stuff. Okay. Round one. Is a is the thrower guy there? No, we got we got cooler dudes. Oh man, I I'm just looking and I'm like, yeah, this stage got big updates, huh? I love this V skill here. This one, it just gives so much more functionality. Can you you can't flash kick it? I don't think, right? No. Nice. Got them bunny girl. Well, they're less bunny girls and more just. Oh, they're magicians! Look at her. Does he still have his crazy kick? No, his kick's gone. His, like, rising kick there that I was doing before. Oh, this just feels just so much better, man. Gotta end it with a German suplex. Or I guess for him it'd be an American suplex, but... His eyes every time. Oh boy, Vega time. Well, again, he can cheat, but at least, at least it won't be as bad, I don't think. Okay. Kind of nice we, we got all the, uh, the original stages. Oh, right, he's in his brown hair, which is his alt, because every game he switches between being brown and blue brunette. I kind of like that. So when we see him in Street Fighter 6, even just as an NPC, my man, oh, I'm getting PTSD from fighting him there. Uh, my man's going to be uh, brown hair again. Because he was uh, blonde in, or no, brown hair in Street Fighter 2, blonde in Street Fighter Alpha, brown hair in Street Fighter 4, blonde in Street Fighter 5. It's going to be brown hair again. Oh, also he can lose his claw in glo in glove here. I forgot that they made him so much easier because of that. I feel like they were planning for that in Street Fighter 2 because of how his AI so drastically changes at the halfway HP mark, which is where, you know, your your HP would be going down. Okay. Good remix, too. Ooh. That's what I wanted. 
That's cathartic. Ooh, that feels good, baby. You win. So yeah, if you, if it's not um, if you're not playing as Vega, the the cage doesn't come down. Carelessness will only get you shot down. You should know that by now. So got time. We're gonna get tiger, 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 tiger. Oh boy, oh boy, do I not miss that. All right. Hanuman Charge. That's a cool skill. I like that name. It's a monkey god, which is strange because he's not really monkey themed, right? Fight. Use your big size against you to easily get uh, flash kicks again. Seems like it. I love when I accidentally, like, jump into the corner of my own volition. It's great. There we go. Flip, 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 flip. put ankles, ankle, ankle rockets there. So yeah, his V-Trigger 1 is, lets him do like, Sonic, Sonic, Sonic Boom. Which I forgot about. Which is, it's fun, but I, I think I prefer, like, like if, if I were to pick one special move for Guile, I much prefer the Flash Kick. Bro, just 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 stand there waiting. What you do? And I don't have to worry about those one in five hundred and twelve attacks, which oh, I didn't even say did happen to me again in uh, in in the M Bison fight there, where I was literally starting the match off mashing light punch, and immediately he threw a sonic boom, and I'm like, oh, cool. I was not even touching the stick. I've overcome worse than you. Yeah, vanilla SF four, am I right? Bison time. Time to beat him up at his bicentennial. Yeah. All right. Classic colors. Classic outfit. Supported by... By this, which you already own. Bow down. It is cool that this game has built-in recreations of every Street Fighter before it, including getting, you know, a, a shortened, but the ending regardless. Oh boy. Oh boy. You're, yep, you're still a boss, and you got even more psycho power than before. Okay, yeah, gotta treat you seriously. Come on. Oh, that sends up projectiles! I never even noticed that! Get that raw jump in. Alright. Look at that dude with the glasses in the background going full chuny. That's me. That's me IRL. Okay, that at least works that this time, right? Even still, the jumping kicks is what really he hates, huh? Okay. Alright. There we go. Didn't end in style or anything, but we did it. We did it. This is not triumphant ending to the music, though, too. I'm gonna make you pay here and now for all the crimes you've committed. Oh? Oh, shoot, did I get to Akuma? Accidentally? Entirely? 
Oh, dang. Oh, dang. Oh, we got to shit Akuma accidentally. Uh oh. Uh oh. I didn't know that I could do that. And that is Shinakuma, because it's it's he's got the the white hair. Oh boy, oh jeez, True Akuma it's called actually. Really, is that the official canon name for him now? Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy! Yep, this is uh this is an Akuma. Interesting they're going with true Akuma as the name instead of Shin. I mean no Shin kinda means like that similarly, but not really. So this gives me one more armor of fireball, like for, for damage there. Oh boy. Oh boy, yeah, this is this is this is not gonna end. This is gonna end about how I would expect me getting to Akuma would go. Oh boy, I don't think I need to beat him. I think it's I think this is an optional fight, right? You lose. Yeah. Well, that was to be expected. I am the one true master of the fist. Hey, we got Queen B. Cool. Not that I would use that as my title. We still get his ending, right? Yeah. Whoa, look at their upgraded designs. I do like how they get different artists in. Even if Bison is killed, I won't bring Charlie back. God leaves behind his quest for revenge. His arms, once used for fighting, will now be used to hold his family close. Yo, the Street Fighter 2 theme is, is iconic, man. It's such a short riff, but it's so good. Thank you for playing. Thank you so much for playing my game. Okay, so. Yeah, that was Street Fighter 2. And we got beat up by Shinakuma because of course we did. Uh, sounds good. I will see you all guys next time for some more. Let's play the Road to Street Fighter 6. Where we're moving on to... Uh, is Street Fighter 2 Dash. Which is uh, Champion Edition, right? Because I'm, 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 I need to double check. Street Fighter 2 Editions. I, and I also realized that when the um, uh, the Capcom Fighting Collection comes out, that has another version in it. So we did the World Warrior from 1991. Next up is, yeah, Champion Edition. So we'll be getting to that next time, guys. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you then for some more. Ciao.